Hi everyone, Jeannie here with Belly Beats here today to bring you a tutorial on how to roll my six millimeter um, round paper beads. This code link is 016542 and what this means is if you purchased a pack of my strips or any of my strips I have in all different sizes and shapes, I send you a link for you to check out on how to roll them. A lot of the packages come with multiple paper strips and I know it can be a little bit um, confusing to new beginners so I thought that perhaps I make this video instead of sending you instructions. Alright so let's begin. Um, you can find my paper strips in my paper bead group called Paper Beads Born Pretty on Facebook or my website at bellybeads.com. I'll put everything in the links below. And what I'm using today is a paper bead roller. This is a 5 32nd um, millimeter uh, paper bead pin. And any type of paper bead uh, roller will work for you, but that's just the number I want to give you in case you want the same size as I'm using today. Also, I use Elmer's Clear Glue, and I love my, my little tube here, and it's really nice because it has a very tiny little needle uh, on here, it looks like, which allows me to um, just pour out appropriately the amount of glue that I need. Now, a lot of you may think that these the glue gets stuck <laughs> I've heard that but I promise you along comes with this um, with this bottle are these nice little plastic rubbery um, tops so if you place your tip on here when you're not using it I promise you it shouldn't get it should not you should have no problems so uh, a lot of times too this may get in the way while you're rolling you can certainly take this off and when you're done you can put it back on but I love these you can also find these in my shop um, on my website at bellybeads.com three of these are for a dollar and they also come with the glue so let's get started uh, the package I have here they all come when you purchase my strips uh, they all come with this with this pay, um, bag and also the sh the, bag, the the strips are straight which I love I don't like to curl them and then when you take them out now this is just this is my six millimeter strip and these are just one strip so it's really nice instead of multiple strips uh, for a six millimeter I love that so there's really not much preparation you need to do if it was multiple strips I would ask you to line them all up so it's a little bit more easier for you and here is my one strip. I'm going to put these aside with my others. I also want a um, quick reminder, make sure you moisture, moisturize your hands a lot. The paper absorbs the oils in your skin, so I always make sure that my hands um, have a moisturizer cream on it so they don't get any cracks in it. All right, so that's my tip for the day. All right, so let's condition our paper, which means to run your fingers through the paper. This allows it to soften up a little bit because it was so stiff and um, kind of straight and hard. All right, once we've done that, we get our paper bead roller. There's a little slit, a little slot or a slit, you wanna say. Place your paper into the slot there and then just begin rolling. I would roll at a nice pace. Um, you don't want to go too fast because then it'll be off center. So just keep rolling and rolling and then be mindful of the sides. If you find that the sides are one side's you know developing a little bit more of an edge you want to pinch your fingers in there and bring them to the center once again and keep rolling. I think the more patience that you have during this process, you'll be able to have a nice, even, and straight uh, round bead. You wanna grab some glue, place a little dab on that, and then just run your fingers through the paper bead, like so, and there you go, you have a nice round bead. Now when you take this off, you want to push instead of pulling and there you go because if you pull it off it will destroy it there is the roundest speed that i have ever seen as you can see it actually rolls and there we go so you can purchase my paper bead strips on my website i'll put everything in the links below and i invite you to join my paper beads born pretty group there's a lot of information in there and uh yeah so have fun thank you very much